The economists Richard Blundell and David Card have won the BBVA Foundation Frontiers of Knowledge Award in the Economics, Finance and Management category. Their research has contributed greatly to empirical microeconomics, providing methods and results applicable to policies based on evidence. They have developed models and methods of data analysis to understand the economic behavior of individuals and homes, and also of companies and their implications for public policies. Both have especially tackled social issues. Blundell is a master at juggling data, economic theory and econometric methods. He has studied the influence of wages and income on household consumption and the hours worked by its members. In particular, how families are impacted by adverse economic conditions and how policy can best be designed to mitigate these adverse events. The aim is to provide an empirical foundation to address many of the key questions in economics. How are savings decisions made? What determines employment and retirement? What factors drive inequality and poverty? And so on. Meanwhile, Card is a pioneer in the use of natural experiments in economics. In this way, he has delved into core labor market issues, such as the impact of trade unions, inequality, minimum wages, unemployment benefits, and welfare programs. He has also analyzed the impact of immigration on the employment of the local population and the impact of education on wage differences. My research on education has shown that um, uh, people with more uh, schooling earn higher wages and it doesn't seem to be uh, simply a result of the fact that they have skills, attributes, family background features, better educated father and mother and so on, that would mean they would earn more otherwise. In other words, it seems to be that actually it's the schooling per se that matters for their outcomes. The work of these economists has significantly shaped policy design in such varied areas as taxation, welfare and pension reform, inequality and product market regulation.